listening and looking at Brad Pitt by Meux, Danish Electronica artist, and releasing her third record tomorrow, Motordrome. Mixes melody, club certified beats, hooks, and licks with some powerful and poetic lyrics. It's all her signature, and here with more is Meux. I'm not even sure I'm pronouncing it right, but I'm as close as I can get. Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> good morning. Hi. <laughs> it's so good to see you. Thanks for, for doing this. You know, we all love your music Thanks around for here, me. and we're, we're, we're just thrilled to Thank talk you so to you. Much. Let's start here. Uh, yesterday, we around here celebrated the 12th anniversary of our parent company's global initiative about mental health. It's called Bell Let's Talk, and it raises awareness mm. and, and big bucks for, for tr trying to erase the stigma surrounding mental illness. Now, this new record of yours kind of has its roots oh, in, a, in a conversation that you had about mental health with your mom. Mm -hmm. Tell us about that. Yeah, that's true. I, after I'd been like for like seven years or something, I'd been like just traveling the world and like making music and touring and doing all these things, which is obviously like really cool. I'm really privileged and lucky mm -hmm. to be doing that. But for a long time, I just didn't really think that, you know, that I had the possibility to really take a break or like take time for myself. Because I think in this music industry, there really is like just like an agenda that's like, keep going, keep, let's keep the wheels rolling. And I think that was when I experienced anxiety and realized being sort of like out of control mm. for the first time in my life I see. Uh, that I need to really take a break and take this serious and just get back into my body. Because for so many years, I'd just been like running on adrenaline, just like, ah, you know. So, so yeah, it was a big turning point for me. Mm. And writing this album really helped me. Yeah, self-awareness. Okay. Self-awareness ain't easy. Look, uh, no. we only had seconds to talk before we came up live. I mentioned to you, I'm Greek. Basically, we eat and we yes. uh, scream our feelings out. <laughs> I want to Beautiful. talk about Denmark. Amazing. Denmark has a reputation as one of the world's happiest countries. In fact, number two in the world list of happiest That's countries true. just behind Finland. How do Danes manage their mental hygiene so well? And, and how have you coped through COVID? I mean, to be honest, you know, Denmark is a very rich country, very privileged, very small. So, you know, I and, and so the government sort of like, you know, we have free health care and free schools and stuff like that. I'm sure that that's something that heightens the general uh, uh, happiness. <laughs> um, and I think, you know, again, during COVID, we've been lucky. Like, of course, there's been lockdown and these kind of things. But but still, a lot of people have had like, you know, just help from the government and like just a lot of a lot of help to, to get in general. So mm -hmm. I cannot complain. You know, Denmark just lifted uh, most of its COVID virus restrictions like days yeah. ago. How, how much have you missed live music as a performer and a fan? Oh my God. I mean, actually both like, I mean, I miss being on stage as a performer so much, but I really, really also just miss being at a show, drinking a beer and just like, ah, mm -hmm. you know, like it's, it's just one of my favorite things because that's when you really connect with a different like with all these people but also with a different part of yourself so yeah so i miss it so much <laughs> i got a final question for you inspiration I, I use this quote often quincy jones once said if you make music for money god leaves the room mm. Mm. what what uh, drives you what, what's your creative <laughs> what's your creative cosmos what does it for you i mean for me like not to sound like too spiritual or anything, but for me, it's about trying to create magic within the real world, like mm -hmm. this alternate reality uh, alongside with the real world. Uh, I think it's a way to just, yeah, I don't know, make life more magical and yeah. Yeah, your music is medicine and it uh, goes down real good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, thank no, you so thank much. you so much. Motor Drome's a new record. It's out tomorrow. I hope everybody goes out and gets it, downloads it, whatever. Have a great day, and thanks for making great music. Thank you so much, and you too.